3SC News Update. Hello and welcome to SS Supply Chain News Hour. I am Allison Lee, bringing to you this week's industry highlights from the supply chain world. Procurement or sourcing regularly in a sustainable manner greatly impacts the road to decarbonization and achieving net zero targets. Although companies have registered for sustainable plans, efforts to maximize profits and generate higher revenues have delayed the urgency to become a net zero company. According to a survey conducted by Officio, 93% of the business leaders stated that it is extremely important to focus on profit maximization and market share growth, compared to 66% of leaders who are keen on achieving their net zero plans and 71% about delivering on social impact. Other difficulties faced by chief sustainability officers correspond to suppliers meeting their ESG goals and incentives related to meeting climate action goals, etc. In a short report, the National Association of Regulatory Utility Commissioners US, has urged utilities to redesign rates at EV charging stations, especially during off-peak hours. This would help in the fast electrification of heavy-duty truck fleets, and mobilizing these incentives would reduce strain on the US power grid, which exists currently. This will not only enable fast development of EV business, but simultaneously provide relief from much-needed pollution existing in the environment. To support vast electrification, rates must be designed to optimize fuel costs, especially for long-haul trucks running on roads requiring one-tenth of the U.S. power generation. Additionally, the electrification of transportation is one of the top underlying priorities identified by the Biden government. India is willing to become a net-zero country by 2070, and the highest investments to support clean energy is made by the Adani Group. Adani has currently invested approximately $70 billion in developing green energy infrastructure as a pledge to achieve climate action goals. A recent report published by Hindenburg Research stated that charges of fraud on Adani Group would primarily downsize the investment rate. It may slow down the pace of decarbonizing the economy. The allegations have equally impacted Adani Green, the renewable energy arm of the group. Since Adani Group is one of the major private investors in India's national climate blueprint, losing its confidence may hamper green financing for the nation. These were the news highlights for this week. We will meet you again with more updates next week.